Hello and welcome to Plutus Voices Portland. Plutus Voices is sponsored by Capital Group. These Plutus Voices events are meant to be small and intimate and give us a chance to talk about uh, subjects that aren't always addressed by mainstream personal finance content creators. And so tonight's speakers are going to talk about the importance of including an empathetic and inclusive approach as well as considering family. I'm Dr. Regina Moore. I am a pharmacist by background. Finance touches all parts of people's life and you can't separate it from any, any one point. We've been working really hard to craft intentional community around shared values. That's why people join the community. And, and we find that having discussions about real life and lived experience helps to bring up a lot of discussions around money that may not start off being about money. People who come from low income backgrounds often, once you get into having those conversations about their experiences, are exceptionally financially savvy and uh, may have a lot more skills than some of us who come from higher incomes do. My name is Debbie Todd. Um, I've been a licensed CPA and financial educator for almost a quarter of a century now, and I grew up on a military pay. We take a slightly different approach to financial literacy. It doesn't matter where you fall on the economic spectrum when they have to wonder about whether they're going to pay their rent or feed their kids. That messes up pretty much every other area of their life. When you can take those barriers down and give them examples that they can see, they will open up. I was brought up in a military family with some, uh, I have a brother. So I did all the things that young dumb people do to waste a lot of time getting somewhere. And we didn't have two pennies to rub together. But I found out that when you get back to the basics with these kids of setting some goals and dreams, they start to move forward and they'll start to open their minds. And they may not retire like fire, right? But if our program can help those families turn it around, to where at some point they can retire, I think that's a very big step forward. But one of the core premises behind our program is we teach whole family financial literacy. We talked a little bit about mindset. Some folks, some families think they can't get out. And with mindset, we also talked about visibility and the fact yep. that finance is not typically discussed. Um, shame and all of those things can definitely impact getting anywhere. 